There's been plenty of surprise over reports that the ex-spouses of former GMA anchors TJ Holmes and Amy Robach are dating. Does that actually happen very often? Questions today about the big switcheroo and that shocking revelation that the spouses of ousted GMA anchors Amy Robach and TJ Holmes are now dating. Their romance is being called trauma dating because they bonded during the romance scandal that cost Robach and Holmes their jobs. We asked relationship expert Wendy Walsh if the relationship between Robach's ex, actor Andrew Hsu, and Holmes' ex, lawyer Marilee Feibig, can last. Could these exes bond over this trauma and walk down the aisle one day? I think they absolutely could get married. I think that bonding over trauma happens all the time with all kinds of different kinds of trauma, and it may be the glue that opens the door to emotional intimacy and mutual care. The news about the switcheroo is reminding lots of people about another high-profile trauma dating situation, that involving singer Shania Twain. Man, I feel like a woman. Back in 2008, Shania was married to John Lang until he became romantically involved with Shania's best friend. The country singer and her husband divorced in the ensuing scandal, and lo and behold, Shania went on to marry her best friend's husband, Frederick Thibault. We slowly became very, very good friends. We had a, we had many months of just trying to make sense of everything, holding each other up. It was a very difficult time emotionally for both of us.